Hello, my friends. Um, I was just doing some work on my computer, about two, and I wanted to show you my little mouse. Um, I just pulled it out because I'm making some things, some programs in Adobe InDesign, and instead of using the tracking pad on my computer, I bet you you can hear that. Anyhow, yeah, instead of using that, I wanted something with more clicks and scrolls and whatnot. So I got this for Christmas last year from my brother who works with computers. He works in a computer. He has worked in computer stores and then he works for a tech company, something or other. And yeah, I'm pretty sure he got these really cheap <laughs> and just gave them to us all. The click is so smooth. Like this is all one solid piece of plastic, but the right click and the left click are so satisfying. The tracking wheel is smooth. It doesn't click or anything. It's pretty easy. There's a little bit of resistance. Um, it's kind of groovy on the sides. And a little bit textured rubber. Can you hear that? Just a little bit. And then the bottom, it can go on any surface, so that's the cool thing about it. You don't need a mouse pad. It doesn't have a wheel. It moves very easily on my desk. It has a side clicker, but I don't have that hook up to do anything on my computer. I'm sure I could program it, but I don't know how. Okay, so on the bottom here, there's a little case for a battery. Just takes one. Double A. And then there's a little on switch. And you can see the light. Hello. Okay, I'll just turn that off for now. Here, this is what I thought was so cute. It's a little button you push. I put it in wrong. I think I did. Just a moment. Oh, there we go. Okay. So if you put it in this button, It's to really get in there, doesn't it? There we go. It pops out this little USB. It's very tiny, see? The USB is, m that's most of it. And that plugs in. My computer. And then I can turn it on again. Bye. I'm going to use this as my mouse. So if I wanted to... Oh, the computer is turning on. Go to Facebook. Scroll up to see my friends. That's something that takes a lot of clicking. I'm going to close that. Let's open iTunes. Don't worry, I don't have my speakers on. Let's open the CD. Arcade Fire, The Suburbs, is now playing. Stop it! Close iTunes. I want to find out information. On. Let's go to blog. Right click here. Open link in new tab. Close that. Okay, now something. Um, yeah, so I'm back to. I can see my little screen now. Um, I when it comes to like seeing the entire dashboard of all the programs so that I can go between them, I don't have that on here yet. I don't know. Maybe 
you know, that side button, this one here, doesn't do anything. Anyhow, that's my little mess. Put back in. Now I'm done using it, so put it away. What else did I want to show you? I showed you all the stuff. I want to already. Hmm. I have something here that I kind of like. I don't know if I want to show you. I don't know if I want to keep a secret. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna give in too easily. What the heck is this? Magazine strips that I cut and wove. It was kind of a fun thing to do. And glue it on. It goes in the other side as well. Now, I don't want to show you what this book is yet. It's kind of a surprise. I just want to show you the side side. These magazine strips. I'm gonna give myself a paper cut from like this. You can probably guess what this book is, but I'll just let you know that there's nothing really else in it yet. If you have figured it out. Now I'm gonna show you the inside cover without you seeing what it is. So it's not woven, I just glued them flat down. Some of the ends are still poking out. I think that's it. This is just going to be a really short video.